What is going on YouTube? Just helping you out here. And for today's video, I will be showing you how to strike through text in Microsoft Excel. This is a useful feature if you want to discard something without actually deleting it. For example, if you wanted to make a to-do list or something, you could strike through the items on the list as you complete them. So it is clear the item is done, but you don't have to physically delete it from the list. So it's a good tool to have for organization purposes. Okay, so if you want to strike through an entire cell, what you need to do is click on the cell. Don't highlight anything, just click the cell. And then from here, you have two options. The first one is you can right click, and then you're going to come down here to format cells. And from here, you want to make sure that you're on the font tab right here. And then you're going to check this box that says strike through, and then hit OK. And now if you see, the vacuum has a strike through on it. And now to show you the other method, what you can do is again, click on the cell. And now instead, you're going to hit this little arrow right here under the font tab. So click that and you're back to this formatting cells window with this font tab here. Again, click strike through, OK, and you have your strike through. Now, the reason I said not to highlight if you were doing an entire cell is because if you have a single item right here and you try to highlight it, and do a strike through, it'll show the strike through, but as soon as you click away, it's gone. So if you have just like a single word or a single number like this that you wanna strike through, you should just click the cell and do not highlight anything. Now, if you wanna strike through part of a cell, that's when you wanna do some highlighting. So say right here, you wanna get rid of prep and and, what you're gonna do is you're gonna highlight just those two words, strike through, hit okay, and you should have just that piece with the strike through. This only works with items that are separated by a space. So if you see right here, I have a full number. If I try to highlight two of the digits and do a strike through on those, again, it'll do that thing where it shows you the strike through, but as soon as you click away, it's gone. And now finally, if you wanna get rid of the strike through, you do the exact same process, just in reverse, click, uncheck the strike through box and your strike through should be gone. And so that's about it for this video. If you enjoyed it, please drop a like, leave a comment if you have any questions or an idea for a future video. And lastly, please don't forget to subscribe and tell your friends about my channel so I can grow and help more of you guys out. I'm just helping you out. See you in the next video.